Hello, welcome to the Job Tracker web tutorial series. In this tutorial, we will show you how to view your tasks. Now that we're in the plan view, we will click on tasks to view all of the tasks for this plan. This is where we can look at all of the tasks related to this project. You can see we have individual progress bars, and you can also see we have rooms here that still need to be completed or that haven't been started yet. This will be your overall task view. We also have these default filters, so these are the three tasks that we can work with. They are task, product installation, and moisture. If I click on this general task button, this will be where you have a mitigation task. Maybe something is damaged when another trade comes through and you want to track a repair. If I click on product installation now, I'm just looking at these product installation tasks. If I click on moisture, here are just my moisture tasks. On the top right of the screen, we have an additional filter where you can go in and select the status of your tasks. In this case, I want to see if there's any tasks for my product installation that are still open. And you can see it's only displaying tasks that are still open, and my completed ones are out of the way. You can also filter by task group. You can even filter by location, type for floor, wall, or elevation. You can search by due date as well. You can even search by who they're being assigned to. If you're a project manager and you want to know what are the tasks that have been assigned to the vinyl install head and we want to drill down at that level, you can use these filters to accomplish that. We also have the batch edit option where you can complete all tasks in the group in one shot. For this example, I will click on my product installation task group. You can check the box next to the task to select them or select all and then click on Batch Edit. Here you can select the status, the percentage of completion, task group, start date, due date, assignee, and watching. After you're done selecting, click Save, and you will then see all the tasks have been adjusted in one shot. If you want to batch delete your task, you will do the steps, but this time select the option Batch Delete, and that will delete all the tasks that you have selected. Next, we will show you how to view all the tasks for all projects that you have created. To get to the project's task view, click on the blue circle with the paperclip icon in the top left. The only difference between the project's view task and the plan's view task is that this will show you all the tasks for all projects and plan's view tasks only show you tasks for that specific plan. We are now here at the project's view, and we can click on the paper icon with the check mark icon in the top right for my task. This is where you can look at all the tasks that you have created so far for all of your projects. Similar to the plan view for tasks, you can see the individual progress bars for all of your tasks. The three task types that we can work with are task, product installation, and moisture. There is also the batch edit options. Thank you for watching and make sure to subscribe to our channel for future videos and information for all MeasureSquare products.